Welcome back to Watching Girls Get Dressed. This is part five. Looking sick, Max. A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka Bra. Yeah, she's yeah, the Maybe best not. style ever. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not Wait. rewind and find out, okay? Wake and bake. Yeah, so this is gonna be the most awkward thing. Oh, hi. I didn't know you were here. The fact that she put the photo next to Rachel is so touching. Ah. I guess men aren't oh so my lucky god, to that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. Oh god. Unknown threatening me again. Uh, let's read it. Touching. Yeah, and that's why I didn't want to read it. I'm going to go back and get that gun. Hey, Mom. Good morning, Joyce. Rachel! Uh, I, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now e. tell me exactly what you want to chow on. Eggs and bacon all the way. I mean, Remember when you guys would sleep night. in until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. We'd wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need what? you to grab me the actual eggs and the bacon. What am I, your slave? I can handle eggs and bacon. I should evolve and become a vegan, but huh, bacon. Mm-hmm. Bacon. Never have to apologize for it. Cause it's so good. Wowza. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. Aw, that's cute. Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. Well, where the hell's the eggs on? I mean, most... I have eggs. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Bacon in my same refrigerator? David, this is Officer Korn. Just want to let you know, your stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the break-ins. What? Give me a call <sighs> soon. Are you in trouble again, Chloe? Don't you sleep? Oh. Yes. Actually, I do. Oh, come on. Hurry up.
Message deleted. Goodbye, message. I think Chloe has earned a break from all this bullshit. <laughs> that ain't no break. Oh, jeez. Can you help me get this bird out of here? What bird? Where the hell do you keep the eggs? Come on, Max. Find those ingredients so we can chow down. The refrigerator in the garage, you know? Oh. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. This might be the one time these people are right. Well, if you say the end is near enough times, eventually you're right. Thanks. What After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but, but. we are on the same page, Max. I keep <clears> hoping <throat> that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. I hate to even think this, much less say it out loud, but I think Rachel is in serious trouble. I know. I watch those awful true crime shows and it makes me ill if I think about Rachel ending up on one. So I don't think too much. I see why Chloe is so obsessed with finding her. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Yes. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. Oh, <laughs> you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Aww. Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila, a breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. Number one, Dad. Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive headline. Oh, seriously? Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never... I guess nobody waters the plant here. I got classes to get to, and I got a really good picture I need to take. My teacher has been really, like, what's it called? Accommodating. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Me too. Alright, how do I stand up? Let me out of here! Seeing you again? Ah, oh, made me remember so I much. I don't have time for this. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. I can get my ass to class. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. 
He had his car out right after this, and... And... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was Thanks. when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? Yes. It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too kids. early to start picking a fight. Eat instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Damn, girl. Uh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly Kill off the, the handle like girl. that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure. Run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. Crazy bitch. Hold on, let's see. Hey. Hey. No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? No, how about Try password? Again. Or one, two, three. I need more clues. Yeah. Come on, this is... Nothing to see here. Try like dad's birthday. Ah, oh, there you go, wedding date. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. No. Stepdad one, two, three. I could try the license number for the password. Six, three, five, six, seven. That may work. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Too long. There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. Why would she need want to? That crazy guy. Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military padlock. Of I can course. even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Okay, that's my password. Nothing in it. Worst hacker ever. Try again. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Oh, well, that's easy enough. Until I end up getting a nosebleed and dying. Nope. No way, Max. What? You totally froze the laptop. Uh -huh. Hmm. Hmm. I should have probably chose that one first. Such wrong. And so, no wrong. way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. What the fuck? That was all my good choices.
Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. No. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. It's a good password. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. 7 2007. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. All right, I think my excuse is running out. Personal. Oh, shit balls. No way, Max. You what? totally froze the laptop. Oh, come on. That was like the perfect password. Oh, I didn't see that. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. No. What did I miss? There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. Well, 7171. Nothing in it. Did I try that one? Magic 8-Ball says no. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Just annoying. Oh. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. That's cute. Could be a password here. All right. I am really bad at this bullshit. I'm almost going to say 607, so let's do that. Worst hacker ever. No yeah, way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Try again. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Are you freaking serious? I've tried everything in a damn plate. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. 
I still need to find the password to David's computer. Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? No, oh, that's a step right there. Nothing to see here. I'm missing one thing. Family. Probably missing the one password. Mm. Frustrating. I could try the license number for the password. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Obviously, David's parents care about him. Okay, that was seven. That date might be a good password. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. <laughs> now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Yeah, but... Let's look at the sun visor one more time. Joyce might as well have wrote, let's get married. That might be a useful password. Duh. I knew I forgot something. Max the hacker strikes again. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Sketchy guy in RV. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. <laughs> Don't trust grown men with goatees. Yes, drugs, but wrong. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Mad Max, Max Factor, Noir Angel. Hey, that's pretty cool. So, go to the lighthouse. I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. Yeah, I got lost taking a. Hi. Nice breakfast. David, you're back already? 
I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. Thanks. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. Thanks. Hi, Dad. <sighs> Figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. Yeah, no. Asshole. You and Chloe think you know more than anybody. Like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody. Like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total oh, paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. You used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? Uh, after what I saw, yeah. You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even threatened me. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Uh, you were smoking pot in Chloe's room. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David. Why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. Yes, David. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, yeah, maybe you. You're turning on me now, huh? Of course. Women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You Ooh. can't kick me out of my own home. I can't it's too, girl. my home, David. Paid for and in my, my name. name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm out flanked. Have a nice day, Chloe. Girl power. For once. Just yeah, please asshole. shut up. Don't I hope Joyce off. doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Oh, you're so wishy washy. Stand up for yourself for once, girl. You did a great job. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? At least somebody's smart. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Chills isn't like kind of like you were turned on, huh? And thank you for watching. Here at a Listen, point. 